Hey LEGO fans and welcome back to a new parts haul video. I have a couple of packages that have just arrived from Brinklinks so I can continue working on my castle for the upcoming contest. So we're just going to open these up and see what's inside. Lots of grey parts for the castle of course including a big old bag of light bluish grey masonry bricks as well as these one by two rounded plates which I didn't have a lot um, in my collection so these will just add some extra texture to my castle walls. This is actually um, for another project that I'm going to be starting in the new year but I figured while I was at the store and they had these flexible hose pieces that I would just grab them in the silver color. These are the toppers uh, for my outer wall. I finally decided on these pieces so I grabbed a handful of these. Hopefully uh, this will be enough. I do have some in my collection already but hopefully this will be enough to top me off for whatever other balconies and such I want to do. And then I just grabbed a couple more pieces while I was at the store. They had this gold trumpet piece, which I do have one in my collection, but now I have a second one and I might use these in this build as well, which is great. So I have a, another one there, great condition. And then I've got some new, new colored frogs to add to my collection that I don't previously have in coral and in magenta and then I do have this trans orange scorpion to add to Brian's scorpion collection which was pretty expensive to get for a little scorpion but had to get it to continue on the collection and then I actually got this printed scroll piece two by two tile which was pretty cool. You can see that there. Very, very cool. I might actually use that in this build as well. Might go uh, well if I do a map room of some sort. So that's it for that box there. And this is a larger envelope. get right into this here. So we've actually ordered a bunch of oh, that's interesting. A bunch of these large Technic brick plates for the Hogwarts crests. I'm going to try and do the last one. I have three out of the four so I ordered nine of these from the seller to actually see if I can build the last press without buying the other kit. And, oh dear, I bought a bunch of these plates and they seem to be loose in the bag so I don't know if one of the bags ripped. There was a few holes in here so hopefully I didn't lose any parts. nine of these and yeah all these parts are all together in this bag but it seems like it ripped in transit so we'll have to go over the parts that I did get and hopefully they're all in there. It's unfortunate that they're all kind of mixed together however I did get some more one by two light bluish gray plates as well as these light bluish gray ingot pieces again for texturing for the walls. Um, I also got a handful of these stud pieces as well again light bluish gray for texturing and then I got a few more of these slow pieces 2x2x3 two two and then the 2x2x3 two two 
with the double slope as well as the single one by two by three to finish off the front wall and any other balconies that I want to put in. And then I'm pretty sure that was about it for the different gray pieces. Unfortunately, they're all mixed together, but I do believe that was it for this haul. So large bag <laughs> of assorted pieces in here and then just some other th things to finish off hopefully the castle walls and a couple of different parts for other upcoming projects that I'll be working on. So that's it for this very great parts order. Uh, thanks for checking out this video today, and if you want to see the project I'm working on, please see the description for a link to a playlist of my updated castle mock. Be sure to subscribe if you haven't already, as it does help this channel out a lot. Thanks again for watching this video today, and as always, keep on building!